Hey everybody, Jeff from Milk Mountain Gear, and today we are going to make stuffed roasted duck. My son and I uh, went out last season and had a great day uh, in the duck blind, and we've got four nice fat medium casualties of war here. I think these are probably widgeon, medium sized ducks. To get them to this point, um, I just spend a lot of time plucking them and uh, I just, I just make sure I get all the pin feathers and so forth off of them because I like the skin on. Um, and that's where we're going to make them today. So the first thing we're going to do is actually make the stuffing. And so we'll get started with that right now. Alright, this is a pretty simple recipe here. Uh, pretty tasty. Got about uh, two cups of apples, coarsely chopped. Got a cup of onion and about a cup of celery. And we're just going to take about a tablespoon of margarine and go ahead and saute this until the celery and the onions are tender. Here we go. Alright, so we got this done. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just set this aside and let it cool a little bit. And we're going to start on the birds. So the first thing we have to do with these birds is we have to season the inside of the body cavity and you can use whatever you like, salt and pepper. I'm going to use Montreal steak seasoning today. I'm going to do that right now. So that's going to mellow it out a little bit as far as the flavor goes and it's going to flavor the stuffing which we're going to put in right now. So what we got here is four lightly stuffed birds. You don't want to cram it in there too hard. And uh, now I'm going to prepare the birds for roasting. And the way I'm going to do that is wrap them up with bacon, which pretty much all my recipes have in it. So here we go. So what I've got here now is I've got these breast side up, wrapped with bacon, use toothpicks to kind of secure the bacon. And the way I like to roast these is I like to use these oven bags um, right here. It kind of makes it, keeps everything more moist and keeps it from drying out, in my experience anyway. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and bag these up. The first thing you have to do with these bags is 
take about a tablespoon of flour and shake it around inside the bag. And so we're going to do that right now and get these birds uh, loaded up and ready to go. So I've uh, got the birds all bagged up, stuffed, and ready to go. Uh, I cut a couple of slits in the top of the roasting bag so the steam can escape a little bit, so the bag doesn't explode, basically. And I'm going to go ahead and uh, stick these bad boys in the oven. I'm going to use my convection oven today because it's probably going to work a little faster than my regular oven. Um, I would anticipate a little over an hour for these four medium-sized ducks. Go ahead and get these in the oven and on the way. Smells good. Ugh, it's about time. I've been a little anxious here. So I went 60 minutes in my uh, convection oven and I'm gonna go ahead and uh, remove this sack here off this. Or at least expose the birds here. That's hot. into one of the uh, breasts on one of these birds to, uh, damn that's hot, check for doneness here. Go ahead and uh, remove our toothpicks. I'm transferring the bacon over to a skillet here. I'm going to brown that up because I like my bacon nice and crispy. Let's slice into this bad boy and see what we got. I'm just going along the breastbone here. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Perfectly done. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to finish removing all the uh, bacon, toss it in the pan, and I'm going to throw this roasting pan in the broiler for about five minutes just to brown up the skin on these birds. So after the bacon's in the pan for about five minutes and the ducks are in the broiler five minutes, I've got some nice crispy brown bacon and some beautiful golden brown ducks. And I'm going to take a bite of this right now.
That is simply awesome. And the stuffing. Is excellent. Mm. And always remember when you're eating wild ducks, be careful or any birds that you've shot with a shotgun. Uh, don't bite down too hard because you're probably going to find a pellet or two and you don't want to break a tooth. Um, make some ducks. Enjoy. We'll see you next time.